Hello, welcome back to Prison Architect. Previous episode, we did like a bunch of small tasks, and those are done. And now we can, you know, add some new stuff to our uh, prison again. And what I want to do is I want to add a death row area uh, to our prison, a death row section. So if you take a look at the deployment, we got max security, we got medium security, we got, uh, you know, protective custody. So we got pretty much everything, minimum security and super max. And then the only thing that we're really missing is death row. And you don't have to do death row because it is like a whole separate thing, right? You do need super max. You do need protective custody. You, know, you do need a medium security area and a minimum security area and a max security area. Those things you have, you need, but the death row is like something extra. So we don't have to do it, but I'm still going to do it. Uh, you know, add the death row section to my prison. And, uh, you know, this is what it's going to look like. So, uh, you know, let's just build it. And then, you know, we can get into it more later on. And, uh, yeah, okay. So, uh, this should also be built. And this is going to be the area where the prisoners are going to be executed. So yeah, <laughs> pretty grim, but still a thing that has to be done. Also, of course, built a perimeter wall around this area. So we can build something like this. Murdered by prisoner. And this is why guy was about to get out as well. So that's really stupid, man. That's really, really stupid. Okay, so we're done building the building. I also put down some uh, secure doors with some door servos. I also did like the plumbing and electricity. Good, good, good. And now we can just start building the cells. And I'm they're gonna look exactly like these ones. So these cells take care of every need of the prisoner, except for spirituality. So spirituality uh, is still a problem with these cells. Uh, but I might fix that. I might fix that. So I might uh, put some praying mats instead of this desk or something. I don't know. Uh, we will see. But we are just going to start building these cells. Uh, first, we have to build a wall here, because otherwise, quick build doesn't work. And, uh, you know, this wall has also been built, so what we can do is we can now start building the other cells. So I just have nine cells, and that's more than enough. You won't fill up, like, uh, I don't think we will fill this up even. I think, uh, you know, six might have been enough. Because you usually get one death row prisoner at a time. And you don't even get a death row prisoner every day. So yeah, I think like nine uh, cells is more than enough. And then we can start building the kitchen, right? The kitchen and the canteen. And once we build those, someone has died, overdosed. Okay, so we also have to build one more infirmary. And once we build this, we can take in uh, the death row prisoners. So let's put a door there. Maybe put a jail door here. And then, you know, let's make this a kitchen. And this has to be canteen. Easy like that, you know. We just need one cooker. One cooker two fridges, a bin, sure, and then a sink as well. And then put down some sprinklers, of course, so this whole thing doesn't burn to the ground. Let's build one more there. And then I also want a recycling bin. Okay, and then we also can do the canteen. 
also should be pretty easy oh i made it a little bit too small but that's no problem we can put it on the other side and then we just need a bench and you know a table now let's do like a small table a small bench Okay, so here we go, all the cells are built, and now we have to deploy some guards here. So I made this protected just for the time being, so no other prisoners would be put in here. And let's make a death row, and also put down some guards. So I'm going to put two guards here, we're also going to put down some trolls. It's pretty simple, like that. And what we can do is we can like assign maybe two guards here. And should we also assign two armed guards or just one? Well, let's do two. Why not? Let's do two. And then I also want a patrol for the dog handlers. Right? So we can sniff out some contraband. There we go. So that's that as well. Uh, I'm just going to put one dog handler. So we have to expand this as well. So we can hire some more armed guards. I'm going to... Maybe three? This guy keeps calling me. He keeps telling me to remove the fistation rooms. And if I don't remove the fistation rooms, he's going to find me. But like eating those fines is way easier than than removing all of these visitation rooms and then rebuilding them. Not rebuilding them, but rezoning them. So I'm just going to eat the vines, the fines, instead of uh, you know uh, getting rid of all of those visitation rooms. So now we got we should have that, right? Yeah, okay. So we do have that, and we can hire some more on guards once these uh, lockers are built so the problem with armed guards is it increases the danger level of your prison so that might be a little bit of troublesome so I don't want to hire too many but I still need a few though okay so the lockers are placed which means we can hire some armed guards and then we can take in some death row prisoners. So they're not available. So like I said, we got like uh, nine cells. But we probably won't fill all of them up. So let's see. Yeah, we just have to wait. So there are no death row prisoners available. And, you know, we just have to wait a few days and some will pop up, I guess. And while we are waiting for some death row prisoners, what we can do is we can build like a pro room and a visitation room. So let's do those things as well. And then let's make this the visitation. So we need some doors here. And this is going to be the pro room. And the pro room is also necessary. So uh, if you want to have a functioning death row area so you need a pro room okay so this is built and i also built like a little pathway a protected pathway so the visitors and pro officers can come here uh without uh, being endangered let's also make this like staff only it's also staff only staff only oh uh, yeah so what we can do is we can turn this into a pro room and this is going to be a visitation. It's going to be for visitors. And this pro room is going to be for this. But it's not actually going to be for parole. It's going to be for something else. It's going to be for death row heal. So that's the thing. Out of save. So what we want to do is we want to do this, death row appeal, and this takes place in a parole room. And it says no time, no regime time slots. Um, okay. 
Yeah, so I think what's happening is, because I don't have any prisoners yet, I get this error. I don't have any death row prisoners yet, so I'm getting this error. And it's a really weird error to give for a problem that lies somewhere, somewhere else. But yeah, we're gonna have to wait until we get like one death row prisoner and then we can uh, plan some death row appeals. Yeah, so uh, let's just wait. And here we go. So I'm expecting a death row prisoner. And I had to wait for quite some time before I got this guy, before this guy popped up. And uh, like I said before, they are few and far between. So you won't get them often. And while waiting, what did I do? I built like an extra infirmary here. So uh, sometimes people die on their way to the infirmary. So I built one more. So, uh, you know, we have uh, a quicker inf infirmary to get to. And then I also put down some metal detectors. I also uh, heated this area. So let's see, temperature. Uh, this place might need some heating as well, but I think and the infirmary also needs some heating. So I'm going to do that in just a second. But let's just first go and see our death row prisoner. Where is he? Okay, he's probably in this bus. This guy. So what's his name? His name is Syntax Lord. <laughs> okay. Can we now click on him? Yes, we can now. So what has he done? Syntax is a mastermind behind the world's largest high-tech... Uh, I don't care about biography, but if you look at the convictions, we see murder, armed robbery, aggravated assault, murder, and once more, murder. Okay, here we go. So Syntax is being brought to the prison block. It's going to be put in a cell. And as you might see in this area, I don't have any common rooms. I don't have any, uh, what else? I don't have a gym. I don't have a yard. That's because death row prisoners never leave their cells. So they're going to stay in their cell. And they will sometimes go to fist station if they have uh, a visitor. And, you know, they might also go to this. So the death row appeal, so there was an error previous time. And now it should work. And it's not working correctly yet. So I'm just going to put these things in the right spot. I fixed the scheduling and now all of these death row appeals take place in a parole room of the death row prisoners. And what is a death row appeal? So these guys are appealing to overturn the death row sentence. So they now have a death sentence, right? Capital punishment. And when they go to a death row appeal, they will try to overturn. And there are three possible outcomes to a death row appeal. So they might be found innocent even. And when they are found innocent, they will just be released. Uh, they will go free. Uh, they might, uh, you know, what one thing they might, what might happen is that the death sentence only gets uh, repealed. So uh, the state decides to not execute this person anymore, but he is still found guilty. So what will happen is this person will turn into a max security prisoner and he will just uh, live out the rest of his life inside of this max security prison. And then the last outcome is that he is still found guilty and the death sentence stays. And once that happens, the likelihood of clemency, this gets reduced. And once this gets below 10%, we can execute this guy. And to execute that guy, we need an execution chamber. And we're going to do that next episode. So I'm going to end it here. And next episode, what I also want to do is I want to build more Supermax prisoners. Or uh, expand this area. Or build like a whole new section. Because look at this. We got 45 Supermax prisoners. And only capacity for 35. 
So we need more Supermax cells. That's also what I'm going to do next episode. So maybe we can execute someone next episode. And, uh, you know, and maybe, no, and surely we are going to build more Supermax cells. So thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like, also leave a comment. Comments really help with the algorithm. And you will be helping me out and subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Bye-bye.